Hello everyone. Welcome back to the YouTube channel Programming Knowledge. In today's Excel VBA video, we are going to see the usage of a very special function that is given to us by Microsoft Excel. This function is known as Paste Special. So to understand Paste Special and its functionality, uh, first of all, let us see that um, what is exactly uh, its usage by using simple Excel and not considering ourselves with a VBA code. So suppose I have some text written here in the cell A1 as TEXT text. Okay. Now I change its format. Say I make it bold. I just change its size to 20 and then I change its color to a dark blue. So this is the format of the text along with the text. And now I want to paste the same format over something else that is written in the cell D6. Suppose I have written Excel in this uh, cell D6 and I want not TEXT text to be written over here, but its format that is size 20 bold and the color blue to be uh, applied over the cell. So what can I do is simply reproduce these uh, steps, but that would be enormous. There are only three steps right now, but it could be where there are a number of steps where you have to just reproduce them. So Microsoft Excel has given you an opportunity of using the paste special function. How can you use it? Simply copy the text you want to copy, then go to your target text or the target cell where you want to paste it. Then in this home tab, there is this clipboard group. Where is this paste the special option? Okay, you can see there are these different options given to you, like here. Okay, where you can just simply use these options and uh, you can even see its preview that what happens to all these things. Okay, so these are all these options given. And if you want to uh, just paste the format, uh, of the text in Excel, then you can use this option known as formatting. And when you do that, you can see that Excel is written as it is as was before, but its format has been copied same as that of the text. So this is the usage of paste special. And not only formats, it could be used to paste the different things. Suppose I again copy this text. And now in this cell, I just want its value to be pasted and not the format, only the value in a simple default Excel. So what can I do is just go to uh, the space values option. Here is this values and I just click on it and only text would be pasted and no values would be pasted. Similarly, over here, I want the width of the cell to be pasted. So there is this option, keep source column widths. If I just paste it, then this width is taken over here. But if I just decrease this width over here and I just try to normal paste, I use a normal paste, then this uh, width is not preserved. Okay. But if I use this different keep source width option over here, then you can see its width changes as well. So that is the usage of paste special. And uh, this is what we are going to see in today's video that how can we apply paste special using the macros. Okay. So for that, what we are going to do is just go to the insert tab and insert a new module. Let's name it something else, say paste special like this and create a sub procedure in it, which is nothing uh, but the starting point of a macro. And I have provided it with the name paste underscore special. And this name is actually the name of our macro. Now open and close the parenthesis. And as soon as you press enter, VB recognizes it as a sub procedure and adds int sub to signify the same thing. Okay. Now what we can do is paste the text. So before pasting the text, we must have some text. So let's define some text. I got a range of cells that is range A2 till A8. That's what we are going to define now. Dot value equals, uh, suppose we provide it with programming knowledge. Okay. 
then uh, this is a target value so let's run this okay uh, but before that what can we do is just clear the contents of the sheet and run it once again okay now if we just run it so we've got this text over here okay that's exactly what we wanted now this is our source text we've got to uh, paste it in our target that is g2 to g8 so first of all let's apply some formatting to this now i'm going to use excel for the formatting but if you want you can also use the vb code for formatting as well the reason I'm using Excel is uh, it's pretty handy and it's no need to write the VB code for that but still if you want it's totally up to you you can use anything that you want okay so this is some kind of formatting that I have applied over here okay now uh, in G2 to G8 okay I have uh, to copy this text programming knowledge without formatting that's it okay so for that what I'm going to do is first use this range function to define my target range which is g2 to g8 then put a dot and then we got to paste it but before pasting we must copy the target text so our text is programming knowledge which is present in the cell range a2 to a8 we first need to copy it so to copy it uh, what we're going to do is use this range a2 to a8 and put a dot copy okay with this the text programming knowledge along with its formatting has been copied now in this we got to use paste special so here is the space special you put a tab and as soon as you press this space key from your keyboard what happens is you get all these kinds of options which you can use to paste uh, over here okay so here what we uh, are going to use is excel paste values excel paste values helps us to just paste the values in g2 to g8 only the value that is programming knowledge would be pasted you can press enter and once you run this code what happens is this programming knowledge is pasted over here and this is actually over here because we earlier changed its format otherwise you can see no formatting is copied only the text is uh, copied or actually the test text is pasted because of this thing excel paste values here it is also predefined in visual basic where excel paste is actually a prefix and values is what we are concerned with now let's change it to something else uh, suppose in the range of cells um, say d3 to d7 that's the range we got to use the space special function once again by pasting the form uh, formats that we have okay so for that what we have is excel paste formats put a tab and now if we press f5 sorry oh uh, let's see the step by step execution okay so the formats have been pasted over here you can test it by writing some text as soon as you write some text okay you can see that the formats have been pasted okay like this up till d7 but if you write in d8 then it's normal okay yeah that was inside the range now uh, we have another option available with us let's uh, use another range of cells say e3 till e8 okay dot paste special put a tab and a space here you can see that in e3 to e8 what we want to paste is just the column widths whatever is the column width of a our target it would be pasted over here if we just write it and then we begin execution execution 
you can see in e3 till e8 what happens is whatever the column width was of these cells has been pasted over here okay so that's how the space special works and if you just use the space special uh, then you can see suppose i'm providing another range of cells say a6 or a10 to a12 dot paste special and put a space then you can see you have got all these options and using these options you can access these different things like if you want uh, if the source text has some comments and you want only those comments to be pasted over at some other place then excel paste comments is what you can go with and similarly if you want to paste the validation rules then you can go with it if you want to paste the formulas you can use this formulas option if you want to paste formulas and number formats you can use this option so uh, these are all these different options if you use excel paste all then what happens is whatever these uh, formatting you have applied will be pasted so let's use this excel paste all and the range target range is going to be f two to f8 okay let's see what happens and let's start its execution in f2 till f8 everything is pasted that is the uh, formatting of the text the text itself and you can see it over here so that's the usage of excel paste uh, all so using these different options you can explore the different uh, properties given to you by the paste special and look for yourself that whatever you are looking for is provided by it or not so that is all for today's video thanks for watching